Good morning, friends. Let's make this no-bake easy key lime pie. You are going to love it. First, we're going to start by making a homemade graham cracker crust. I love to use the cinnamon because I think it just adds just that, just that little bit of yummy flavor to it. And so what you do is you take two of these sleeves and you crush them very fine. And then you're going to add them to your bowl. I'm down at the office today and we don't have a food processor. So I just put it in a Ziploc bag and then I just smashed them <laughs> really well until they get nice and crumbly like this. And then to this, we're going to add a half of a cup or one stick of melted butter. And then we've got two tablespoons of sugar. And then we're gonna take this and we're going to mix it all around until it gets really well incorporated. Now that our crust is all, all that butter is in that, those graham crackers, now what we're gonna do is we're just gonna take our pie plate and we are going to just add our graham cracker crust to this and then I'm going to show you a little trick okay then what you do of course we're going to kind of spread this out a little bit but one of my favorite tricks is just take like a measuring cup and you're going to press down and then you just gently press it toward the edge of the side like this now i'm just going to take my graham cracker crust and i'm going to go put it in the freezer for about 10 minutes to make the key lime pie filling, this is what you do. You need to get three blocks of cream cheese, and I've already added that to my bowl. And then what you're gonna do is you're just going to mix this really well until it's nice and smooth. Now that the cream cheese is mixed very well and it's nice and smooth, we're gonna add a 14 ounce can of the sweetened condensed milk. And this is where all the good stuff happens. Next, we're gonna add three quarters of a cup of lime juice, and I just bought this, the real lime, and you're gonna add that. It makes it so much easier to just go ahead and buy that lime juice. And then you're gonna take one tablespoon of lime zest, and you're gonna add this. And now we're just gonna mix this up really well. So yikes, I forgot to actually <laughs> video the part where I'm mixing up the filling. So trust me, I did it. The last thing we're gonna add is just this eight ounce Cool Whip thawed and we're gonna fold it in. And oh my goodness, I can smell that lime. I love anything citrus, orange, lime, lemon, so good. And then you just start to just fold this in. I've taken my graham cracker crust out of the freezer. It just kind of helps it to set up a little bit more. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna add this delicious filling into our pie plate. This looks so delicious, you guys. And I will tell you that I may have licked the spatula. Now, to finish this off, I have just got some lime zest and a little bit, and I'm just gonna sprinkle it on the top, just for a little, just to make it more beautiful. And then you'll put this in your refrigerator for about four hours to let it cool and set. And your family or friends are gonna love it. All right, what did you guys think? Wasn't that so easy and so simple? And I promise you, it is delicious. I have been licking that spatula. But I'm gonna go ahead and put this in my refrigerator for about four hours, and then I'll take it out after that. But I have some things to get done today, so that's gonna be the end of my video. And so I hope you guys enjoyed that. I wanna remind you guys to be stronger every day, know that you can do hard things, have hope, 
and also know that everything is figureoutable. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Take care. See you soon.